you ever felt. Are you listening? Damn. Uh. Hey guys, long time no see. 50 years later and 50 pounds heavier. But for real, it has been a while since I posted anything here on YouTube. But I'm still here, Heeny. Oh wait, that's luck. Fixed. The reason I haven't been posting a lot, a lot has happened in the past year. Some good things, some not so good things. You know, a lot has happened and a lot didn't. Either way, I'm still here, he No, we're not doing that again. So I decided to make a video of my top five resolutions that I have for 2018. Granted, I am a month late, but then again, I haven't posted a video in like two plus years. Anyway, without further ado, here are my top five resolutions for 2018. Resolution number one. So I've had some financial goals. Last year was mainly focusing on, you know, keeping my head above water. But yes, uh, one of my financial goals is to save a little bit of every paycheck that I get. So that way I accumulate, you know, kind of a large sum at the end of the year. Once I have that large sum at the end of the year, I'm going to use it to travel. If I get the time off. <laughs> if I don't, hey, I got this money here. I'll roll it over go to a better place. Instead of going to Paris, Texas, I'll go to Paris, London. Nice. Stay in school, kids. Resolution number two. I mean, it's no mystery that I've always been struggling with weight. So I currently weigh 222 pounds. My goal weight for the end of 2018 is 170 pounds. It is a very drastic uh, weight drop, but it being the beginning of the year, I'm pretty sure it could be accomplished. I've been starting to go to the gym a lot more, and I am thinking of making some changes to my diet pretty soon. It's very hard, because I love me some Whataburger, I love me some Canes, I love me anything deep fried and smothered in chocolate. Besides losing weight, I also do want to work on some other fitness goals. I want to be, I've been doing a lot more leg workouts, so I want to be able to be able to squat or whatever it's called 180 pounds. And I want to be able to bench press 100. Very weak. It might not seem a lot to many of you, but to me, it would be a pretty big accomplishment. So that's something I'm going to be drastically working on, and I will show you the end result at the end of the year. Goal number three. Now, I'm like a lot of the population of the world. As soon as I get home from work or wherever, I just sit down, turn on TV or my computer, and watch Netflix, Hulu, any other streaming service, and just watch all these shows and I watch a lot of YouTube too but I've been thinking that I want to kind of start doing something a little more productive so my third goal for 2018 is to read more so I got two books for Christmas this year both from two youtubers that I completely love so much so in January I started reading one of my favorite favorite youtubers of all time his book his second book actually New York best time seller it gets worse by Shane Dawson. So I read his first book, it was hilarious. His second book is even more hilarious. I watched Shane since like way back in the day, back in those Weight Watcher, Shanae, Fred is Dead days. Nowadays he's doing com content that's a little bit more different, but hey, I'm still into it. The stories that he has in there, it's just a collection of essays about his life, and it also includes some amazing artwork from very talented fans of his. You should definitely take a look at that book, it is amazing, it'll have you laughing your ass off. I remember like sitting like in bed next to my boyfriend and just reading the book and just being like laughing like a complete lunatic. <laughs> And this month, actually, I started reading um, How to Be a Boss by Lily Singh. She's also one of my other favorite YouTubers. She's very motivated. She always has this message about, you know, working hard for everything you have, having a strong foundation. <laughs> but it's a very inspirational book. Lily Singh is a very talented uh, YouTuber and amazing content. And I totally recommend also reading her book. My fourth goal for 2018 is to cook more. My goal is to learn two new recipes every month. This month, it's a new recipe that I tried uh, with grilled chicken. And the second recipe that I learned was uh, how to make a pink starburst drink. 
It was very good. It tastes just like the same thing. And finally, my fifth goal. Granted, I have many goals that I want to accomplish by the end of the year, but this, but these are the main goals that I want to stay focused on for through for the duration of 2018. My fifth goal is I want to start posting on YouTube more regularly, or I want to start posting on YouTube again. <laughs> I remember posting my videos in the past, they brought me so much happiness, they brought me kind of like a sense of like, I like, I love what I'm doing, like waking up every day thinking, or like waking every day before making a video, I always felt happy, felt excited, full of energy, and I kind of miss that, and <laughs> it's very fun, it's also very nerve wracking because it's a video you're putting out there, something that you worked really hard on like filming so many outtakes, so many like hours like editing, trying to find things. It's very difficult but at the end of the day once you see the finished product it's so worth it and it's something that I want to start doing again. So as part of my fifth resolution of um, posting on YouTube, like I am going to be posting on YouTube twice a month. It doesn't seem like a lot, but it's something to get me started. But yeah guys, those are my top 5 resolutions for 2018. Thank you guys for watching. You are all my faves and expect more things coming out soon. Love y'all. See y'all next time. Bye!